here for another episode of my LP. I know it's been a while, but yeah. Um, yeah. So far, I would have done this episode. I've done a few things. I tried to record this once or twice before, and it wouldn't record. But yeah, anyway, if I can uncover the footage, I'll just end with that. Anyway, yeah, I've got a, I started an animal farm here. I just wanted to get a few more things going, start an animal farm and all that stuff. I also, like, one thing I wanted to mention, two more things I want to mention. When I have timber mod installed, which really helps, it makes it a lot easier to cut down jungle trees, and, like, why not? It saves tool durability, and it's a lot more interesting and fun to watch. Anyway, yeah, so I got my face up there. Like I said last episode, I was going to get some more work on the house done. And I've done quite a bit, actually. No, I know jungle wood planks aren't the best, but it's what I got while I'm here. But anyway, one of the other things I recorded before was a little bit of building it. And I got Uchi here. It's a little food bowl. And, I don't know, clay. And, yeah, it's Uchi. I caught a cat and I was recording that. Anyway, another thing I got is I've got, um, I've got storage, you know? I've got things laid out like that, the way BWO and Hundred does it. And I'm thinking of using these chests just for other wood stuff until I get like another side for like stone and whatnot. But for now, I'm just using it for random stuff, random blocks, more more random blocks. And I'm using this one for saplings and other like wood related things. Anyway, right here I've got my design for like easy furnace. Got tons of charcoal. Just press the button and keep holding it down for as long as you want the coal to come out. And then, yeah. Obviously, it would be easier just to go in and take it out, but still. Bed and my diamond from last episode. And, yeah, that's pretty much it so far. Ladder going up to the rooftop. Anyway, I am thinking of. Oh, yeah, before I say that. I'd like to, one thing I met almost was, I almost said last episode was how I got the iron for these tools and yeah my stone my iron axe broke while making the house. Um, how I got the iron for the tools when I was mining out the mine the, the um that mine there I um found some iron on the way and it was just about enough I think I had one extra which the iron ores and the, oh, the chest. yeah there um I didn't cook it. Anyway, yeah, and one, one other thing a lot of people are probably wanting me to do this episode is make a diamond pickaxe, and I am going to do that. First diamond pickaxe. I still got more diamonds if I die with it, so it's not the end of the world. <laughs> I'm not the end of the world if I die with it. And yeah, so yeah, I've got my big axe. And just going to get a little bit more armor, armored up before I go. A really good idea. And I forgot I didn't have any more materials. Anyway, I'm just going on now, aren't I? So, I am going glitch. I am going to go out into my into a cave or something, not that mine yet. And I'm going to go look for obsidian. I'll have to let water in or something in some way. When I, but I'm going to head off this way because I think I saw lava in a cave back this way. Like somewhere around here. Yeah, there it is. I think there's lava down here. Yeah, I was right. So yeah, anyway, um, I'm going to get the iron over there for sure. Always good to have more iron since I'm so early in the LP. And like I said, I've got a diamond pickaxe. Even if I do die with it, it's not the end of the world. Because I got more diamonds. So yeah, this is good. Love iron. Dang it, that one's gone. I'm going to go down and get this. There's lava. I am going to use this as scaffold. Lava. 
feel the heat. I'm not going down for that iron. I'm going to go for the iron that's up there. Maybe for that gold later. With this next iron, next piece of iron, I'm probably going to make armor. set up a small camp here and make a furnace and stuff. Yeah, yeah I would. I'm going to smelt the iron and then First, I'm going, to, yeah, I'm going to use some plain wooden planks as fuel. Four iron. Wooden planks. But yeah, I'm going to see if I can get that loft up there. I mean, the iron up there. One down here, I'm going. Well, that's the. That's holding shift. Well, now that I'm down here, I'll get this gold. That was weird there. I was holding shift. Alright. How's the iron doing? Three iron. Alright. I am now acquire hardware, and I'm going to get a bucket. It's nice on this lava, go back up to the surface, and yeah. There we go, lava bucket. It should deplete, I'm not sure though. No, it's not going to. Yeah, I'm going to start heading out of the mine area thingy revolver. To do that, I'll probably have to go up a level. I know I'm wasting kind of slab, wasting slabs and all, but one thing that surprises me, I'm not getting too many mobs either. Like I mentioned, I do sometimes plan on peaceful mode. I'll check that once and see. Check it now. Yep, peaceful mode. Like I said, I have another map I play peaceful on a lot. And I'm almost out. <sighs> yep, I'm out. We can get four buckets of lava. From down there, like there's a lot of lava. Maybe I, I'm not sure if the infinite lava source has been fixed. Anyway, I'll be right back once I got more. Infinite lava source, moment of truth. <gasps> it works. And that's not really lava. Nope, it doesn't work. Never mind. It worth a try. Alright, I went back, got some more lava. That's pretty much all of it now. And I need a water refiner and hope for obsidian. So, yeah. Obsidian, here it goes. First pieces of obsidian. I'm going to start with making a portal to the nether. Maybe later I'll do an enchantment table. Probably also want to do it, make a diamond sword now. 
the diamonds I got my name. Anyway, we'll be right back. Alright, I finished mining up all the obsidian from those racks. And I was thinking about a place to put the portal. And I thought that maybe back in this area, like this cave, would be good. Because it's like not literally not in the way. It's not too far of a walk to get here. And I think it would look really awesome to have a portal just sitting in the cave. So I'm just doing the um, cobblestone one. I want to be able to see all four, four corners, even though, like, you don't. No, you don't need to see all four corners. And I will go get a flint and steel, I guess. We'll just have to cook the iron ore from earlier. And I'll get a piece of gravel and keep breaking and placing it until I get flint. And yeah. So. You got the um, gravel and here, just you know, only need one. And oh, I've already, oh yeah, I cooked that ironing it already. Is that just glitch? That was awesome. Super glitchy glitch. I don't know how that works, but. Oh, one now. Does it look like trying to do with the properties of getting it? Can you just be doing that? Oh, no, no, there we go. The chest didn't make noise when I opened it. That's weird. That's really weird. So you glitch around here. Um, so yeah, you got your flint and steel. And I will go run over to the portal to light it at sunset. And we'll head to the nether. No, I'm not copying that, but still. Here we go.